Alrighty, um, I thought I would save this for Halloween, but I think I'm just going to do it today, do my early Halloween. Um, I'm Matthew, this is my favorite game, Half-Life 2. I'm playing the Half-Life 2 update version, and... Ooh, spooky. Um, yeah, Half-Life 2 has a very uh, standout map chapter named We Don't Go to Ravenholm. And it's a horror chapter that is very well made. And I'm going to play it today in the spirit of Halloween. So, yeah. So, yeah, we just got out of that tunnel and we get this gorgeous vista. We know something's wrong immediately. And of course, we were just given the gravity gun. I think you're supposed to be able to punt that. I think they might have messed it up in the Half-Life 2 update. But yeah, we're we're kind of forced to use the gravity gun here to continue. And we see this, which is very obviously, huh, so that happens. And then we're required to remove it to proceed. And I think there's a trigger as soon as we remove it, one of them spawns, and... There you go. Serendipitous. And this is where we're introduced to how these things work. For the days of
There's an achievement for playing this whole chapter without using anything but the gravity gun, but I've never gotten it. <laughs> but who is this? Another life to save? I'll keep my eye on you. More than that, I cannot promise. stuff. a waste. Big waste. Kind of cheating a little bit here. But that's a poison head crab. Normally, if it hits you, it brings you down to one health, and then you slowly regain it back. Supposedly, your uh, neurotoxin. Detected administering antidote, so you slowly regain health back. But that is a very scary enemy in this because if you get hit by one of those and then even take minor damage, you'll be dead. That's kind of an interesting mechanic. Alrighty. And then, of course, a bunch of these guys spawn in as soon as you go down and activate a trigger. Bad kitty.
Well done, brother. Make free use of my traps, but take care not to fall in them yourself. Behind you! In Ravenholm, you do well to be vigilant. And better. I am Father Grigori. You have already met <laughs> my congregation. <laughs> Life goals. I want to be like that when I'm old. Yeah, normally if you shoot that, uh... Oops. Well, you get the idea. So, be smart before you shoot. It is you, brother. I apologize. But no harm done. My bullets are the least of your concerns. No, father.
don't know if I've ever done that before. Interesting. Although they call me crazy, I care not, for thou art my helper. They were trying to do experiments to save these people, but it doesn't look like it were turned out well. Here, brother! Come closer. You've stirred up hell, a <laughs> man after my own heart. Here, I have a more suitable gun for you. You'll need it. Catch! Good. Now, keep it close. My advice to you is, aim for the head. 
Hush. They come. There is no rest in Ravenholm. Move on and I will meet you at the church. So they actually don't jump at you unless you're looking at them, believe it or not. They discovered that from a source code leak a while back. It's not my day. This would be really scary if uh their pathing was better. waste of ammo. Ah, uh, peace and quiet. I think this might be the first time we're introduced to these guys. Oh yeah, this part. Unfortunately, in this area, there's infinitely respawning enemies. I would used to get lost here all the time. Yeah, and then you try to hide here for safety. Go, ha ha ha. What? So that's a fun little thing they do. But yeah, infinitely respawning. Kind of ridiculous.
guess that thing's dangerous. That's never happened to me before. Where'd he come from? Almost died there? So yeah, you can easily get stuck here because there's a lot of enemies and they just keep respawning infinitely. And I think that triggers some spawns of fast zombies. <laughs> Yeah, so this confused me because I, for the longest time, I didn't realize I had to go up here because it is a loop.
And so they make this trapdoor one way so you can't come back in here, but this is on a timer. Ah, there you are. At last. I will send the cart for you, brother. It will be but a moment. Patience, brother. Guard yourself well. Send it, Father. So I forget if they change this to where you have to kill some of these. But usually I think you can just start the trigger and then just hide in here. Release it and come down. May their paths become dark and slippery, and may the angel of the Lord afflict them. Greetings, brother. And so we meet at last. You are to be commended for avoiding my traps. Uh, the work of a man who once had too much time on his hands and now finds time for nothing but the work of salvation. I suspect you have little wish to remain in Ravenholm, so I will show you to the mines. As for me, a shepherd must tend to his flock, especially when they have grown <laughs> unruly. Alrighty. Follow me, brother, and tread lightly. For this is hallowed ground. Over here, brother. Over here, brother. Quickly, brother. Stay close to me, brother. I wonder if this game ever released on the Nintendo Switch. If they haven't, they should definitely do it. It can definitely run on it.
And if you do abandon Father Gregory here and just let all the zombies go at him, he will die. Uh, you can lose from that. Ow. Father. Nothing worse for you. I fear I deliver you to a darker place. May the light of lights illuminate your path. Look to your own salvation. <laughs> uh, I don't think he's supposed to do that. Walking in the fire, that is. That's a bug. So yeah, I should probably be playing just vanilla Half-Life 2 instead of the Half-Life 2 update. But too late. So the floor is lava, basically. Forget if that section collapses on you.
that's not supposed to happen. And yeah, that was Ravenholm. So, should probably stop here. Thanks for watching.